No one has ever done anything like this. That's why it's going to work. Peace, AGG Nation. This is AGG, the average gun guy. And today, guys, we're going to be doing the 2000 round Jackal review. You don't want to miss this one. Be back in just a second. <laughs> All right, guys, just like the intro said, we are back for the 2000 round Jackal update and review. So let's take a look at it. There's been a few changes and additions since you guys have seen me last time with this Jackal since I went and first picked her up. Well, one of those things that we did was we added on a nice light, HRT weapons light. As you can see, we got that up on the front. It's got the nice little in, uh, toggle switch. Definitely a unique design, but I like it. When you get that C-clamp, boom, boom. As you can see, I can hit that light very, very easy. But yeah, guys, I don't want to go through all of this, the specifics once again, as far as like from the tip to the butt. You guys got that last time as far as what muzzle we have, um, what, I mean, what compensator we have, you know, all that good stuff. Hand guard, got a BCM hand guard, all the basic stuff, guys. Let's also make sure she's clear. She's clear. Aim in a safe direction. Boom. All right. So um, let's get that going. All right, let's talk about it a little bit. Let's talk about it. Something that I have added since the last time you guys saw me was the Rise Armament 535 trigger. There you go. I got you get a look at that. And she is nice. She is nice. There you go. All right, so let's go ahead and see how she sounds. As you can see here, it's got a nice, nice design to it. Nice crisp wall. There is no take up. That was it. Boom. Boom. Let's do that one more time. Boom, as you can see, it's already on the wall. Let's look at that take up. Bam, boom. Very crisp, very audible. I have fallen in love with the Jackal since I've had it. This gun is not only beautiful, not only feels good, shoots good. As you guys can see in the video, shoots super smooth, super, super smooth shooting. And um, all the, the feedback or all the, the um, hype, should I say, out there that's saying that this thing has a lot of um, weight to it. Don't believe the hype, guys. Don't believe the hype. I mean, if you think this is too heavy for you to handle, go out there and uh, lift some weights, do some exercise and do something to get yourself in shape. Because this gun is definitely the perfect size. This is the 13.5 barrel length. I mean, man, it's ready, ready to be comped. This is the, the pin and weld version. So we, we are ready for a suppressor. Excuse me, it's not ready to be comped, it's ready to be suppressed. And we have a nice dead air Sandman S coming on the way. We are right now in a ATF holding court, waiting for that approval, but it's coming. So yeah, guys, nothing else has been changed on here. Of course, I added the Hollowson and the, um, the, the 3X magnifier here on top. Got me a nice sling, mag pull sling, quick detach design. I like that. I like that a lot. I like these um, mag pull uh, slings. Really like them a lot. And uh, that's it. So um, let's get some some footage. Let's get out there and show you guys some footage of me shooting and uh, getting some more rounds down range. But yeah, guys, if you're in the market for getting you a jackal, go out there and pick one up. And if you want a discount, guys, look at look at the link tree that's in my description or that's in the description of my channel. Head on over to PSA, use my code, get you a nice discount, and get out there and start shooting with the Jackal. This is a very, very nice, nice, nice firearm, especially if you want something that's a little bit different. I know a lot of people have AR-15s. A lot of people have AK-47s. Well, man, this is like the, the best of both worlds. You got your, your charging handle here. So it's not like your typical AR that has a charger hand on the back. There's no buffer tube system, of course. This is, as you can see, folding stock. Stock does fold, super easy. Locks right back in place. 
Nice, very, very nice and comfortable. Very easy to adjust here. As you can see, we can shorten her up if we need to. Let's pull it out. The, um, the cheek well is also very easy to manipulate. Once I figure it out, you just pull it, pull it out, you know, flatten it out, pull it back again, push it up and push it down and she's back up again. So very, very nice, very, very nice. Not much else I can say about this gun, guys, except that um, she has been nice so far for me. So far, so good. So far, so good. And especially with that new trigger. Man, this thing shoots like a champ. So let me get you guys some footage. Be back in just a second to wrap it up. PSA Jackal, first shots, first at the range. Just installed a new RA armament 535 trigger in there. Best drop trigger on the market, guaranteed. Well, let's go. Let's see what it's like. Pretty. So nice, smoking so hot, fogged up my glasses. Gotta let my glasses on. Let's bring it back. Let's see what. You know I'm surgical with this bitch, Jake. Some 510C and 3X magnifier on there. Did not cut it in yet. So this is what we work with. But so I knew where my sights was at. I knew what was hitting there. So long as we stand in that range, we good. We good. We good. good. We good. Looking nice. Looking nice. And man, this jackal shoots so smooth. No recoil. None at all. Non-reciprocating charging handle. Charging handle non-reciprocating. Gas is already set perfect. Let's throw another mag in there. Keep it going.
Boy, tell you every time we come here, they got it super hot. Hot as heck up in here. Get it, throw it right in. You get it right in the middle. You need it. Get a little double, a little double tap. You can uh, you can shoot signals back if you want. You shoot whatever you want. Have you shot? Gracias, amigo. Thank you. All right, bring this bad boy on home. Thanks. All right, you okay? This has to be up here. Gonna send it. 25 yards, see how it All right, guys, so I hope that you've enjoyed today's video about the PSA Jackal 2000 round review. If you got any questions, drop them down in the comment section. Make sure you hit that subscribe button, hit that like button, especially if you are, if you are what we call a return reoccurring viewer and you're not subscribed yet. Make sure you hit that subscribe button, guys. Hit that like button. It helps the YouTube algorithms know that this is something that other people want to see, pushes it out there so everybody can get it. All right, guys, stay safe. Stay training and stay free.